Hi, I'm Liz. And I'm Charlie. And we're the Adventure Closet. And today, we're going to Arches National Park. Let's do this. Yeah. Hi, I'm Liz, and my other half is Charlie. And we are exceptionally frugal. That's why we're traveling the U.S. in our minivan Opal, paving the way for others to see that traveling on a budget can be quite fun. We love the outdoors, and we have tried to avoid cities, do lots of hiking, and have a strange obsession with rocks. So hop in the van, and let's see what kind of adventure we can find. We are going to enter Arches National Park with a lot of other people. A whole bunch. They stole our idea. Types of highway vehicles, including registered something or others, are prohibited. Are prohibited. Prohibited. But it did, did. All right. Double lane lineup. Pulling out the pass again. Still in line. There's a line behind us too. I think we should stop going to national parks. Probably. What do you guys think? I don't know, it's cool to see them, but uh, at the same time, it's a lot of people. It's not our, it's not our bag, baby. Yeah, and sometimes the most impressive things are the things you happen upon, not the things that you heard about and went to go see because your expectations are already high. So I like to keep my expectations low. Yeah. Yeah, maybe we'll hold off on national parks for a while. Maybe we won't, because, I mean, we're near Bryce and Grand Canyon and blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it does feel a little bit wrong passing them by, but still, like, I think we have more fun outside of the national parks. Yeah, because we're not sitting in these lines and yeah. waiting. And then, you, you know, you get up to the pull-up areas uh, for the viewpoints, and it's just like jam-packed full of people. We just found Hawaii in line here at Arches. So that's one of the hardest ones to find mm -hmm. and knocked it off the list. Yep. Hawaii. That's where they keep all the good rocks. Oh, <laughs> I can't get up there. <laughs> I don't think anybody can get up there easily. How rude. The sign says that there's a po there used to be a possible arch there and there across here.
So the reason this holds up so well, the balanced rock, is the balanced rock is made out of slick rock, which is sandstone. And then underneath it's mudstone that's more sticky and holds it up there. Very cool. This is the Garden of Eden viewpoint. We're getting ready to go hike the windows. Pretty excited for this one. We chose the primitive trail over the main trail and there's nobody over here. <laughs> Great choice. Plus you're surrounded by the landscape. Walking a dirt path. It's beautiful. Sometimes the road less traveled is the most beautiful because you're allowed that feeling of serenity. It's quiet. All you hear is your own footsteps. All you see ahead of you is nature. The most beautiful landscape. As far as the eye can see. So there's this circle in the ground here. It's like a circle of stone. And just up from it is this cave. And I bet you there's artifacts up in that cave somewhere, or at least there was. And it's next to one of the arches. It's also next to this which looks like a circle of monument stones, which is really cool looking. Some of these junipers remind me of bonsai trees. I love bonsai trees. They're the coolest. I would love to have a bonsai tree, but I have no patience for one. And bonsai takes many, many, many years of patience. Well, we are back on the main trail, but we're coming up to an arch that really looks cool. It's the turret arch, and it has a window and a big arch, and it just looks like a castle. So, I'll give you a view of it. First, say hi to Charlie. Hi. Woo! This is pretty cool. It is full of people. Yeah. But this is amazing. Wow. Hey, this whole walk was really nice. <laughs> yeah. 
I'm so greedy to want this for myself. I understand why people flock here. It's amazing. No, we were just saying we had no urge to go through the other arch. This one I had urge to go through. <laughs> yeah. Because there was something inside. There's that little window. We're going to do delicate arch lower. Uh, we're not going to go out to the arch because there was like 500 million people at that parking lot and they were all headed out there. Yeah, which kind of worries me about the viewpoint of the arch. Is it going to be speckled with people? So we'll find out. What you doing, babe? Uh, we have this problem with rocks. We opened the door. And when I open the door, this is the second time it's happened in like at arches. Um, all our rocks just spill out everywhere. <laughs> it's hilarious because it's loud when it happens. Yeah, it sounds like a bunch of glass breaking. <laughs> this is from the lower viewpoint. So we are by the Devil's Garden Trailhead, which is a hike I really want to do. It's the end of the day and I think we're going to have dinner here at least. But it looks cool. This is where we're going to have our dinner. The Devil's Garden picnic area. Beautiful.
How is it? Really good. It's awesome. We found water. Scraping the dishes. This is what I do while he washes dishes. Life is hard for Liz. So hard. <laughs> now he actually forced me to sit here. My back is giving me so much trouble today. Which sucks. But at least I got out of dishes. The moon is rising. That is so cool. Time to get gas in Moab again. Yeah. And then figure out what's next. Just spinning the wheel or something. I don't know. Yeah. Moab has been our hub for several days now and yeah. it isn't a bad place to be to for adventuring yeah plus having some amenities here in town like gas like gas yeah <laughs> and auto parts stores yeah <laughs> filling up in moab utah 369 a gallon yeah i can pump gas too i can also drive but I don't know why, but Charlie just insists, so yeah. Maybe I'll wash the windows too. It's 38.92 this time. About a half a tank. Not bad. Not good. Money out yeah, is... It's bad. I don't like spending money on gas. Nope, who does? Uh, and my ears are burnt to a crisp and they look horrible. And I need to do something about that. Well, that was fun. This was so much fun. Arches is amazing and I take everything back that I said at the beginning of this video. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I guess we're not tired of National Park. <laughs> yeah. I think we were just tired. Yeah, and we're learning quickly how to get around the people. Take the primitive trails. Take the primitive trails. You get unique shots. Yeah. As, as you probably noticed through our video, if you've been to Arches, you probably saw some angles you didn't if you came the main trail. Yeah. Um, wow. 
Don't forget to like and subscribe, and we'll see you next time. Yeah, thanks for supporting us, guys, and coming along on the adventure. Um, you guys are a huge part of this. I know I say it a lot, but I mean it. Bye now. Bye now. <laughs>